As part of our new lake monitoring program, the Lake Simcoe Conservation Authority has started using benthic invertebrates to monitor the environmental health of Lake Simcoe. Benthic invertebrates are animals which live in the bottom of the lake. Most people are familiar with things such as crayfish, clams, mussels, and also insect larvae. And these animals live under rocks, in the mud, or also in the sand. These animals are sensitive to environmental changes in the lake, and they also have different tolerance levels to pollution. So what species are found can also determine what the environmental conditions of the lake are. For example, the larvae of midges, which appear in the spring as thick clouds of flies, these larval stages can survive in areas of very low oxygen, so this can have implications on how much suitable habitat exists for bottom-dwelling species such as trout. Protecting Lake Simcoe is a collaborative effort, which is why our partnerships are so important. Those have been a collective effort by individuals, farmers, community organizations, municipalities, the province, and of course the Lake Simcoe Region Conservation Authority. We monitor benthics by taking a grab sample of mud from the bottom of the lake. We then take this mud and strand it through a series of sieves. We observe the animals under a dissecting microscope so we can find out what is living in what area. While setting up these monitoring programs in Lake Simcoe, it's a relatively new process. Over the coming years, we will be able to monitor the environmental health both in the present and also how the changes occur in the coming years. Uh, one thing that is taken for granted is water. And it, with the Conservation Authority's help and assistance, public awareness, uh, everybody starts to realize just how important it is. You've got people that know the expertise in that field, allowed to do the work that they know best, and uh, that, that's a good way to have it. The greatest benefits of this study will be improved knowledge and scientific understanding of the processes of Lake Simcoe. So by studying these benthic invertebrates, we will be able to evaluate how much freshwater habitat there is for fish in Lake Simcoe.